Yeah, this is gonna be my uh, video about one of my, my most one of my most favorite DC comic book heroes. So it's it's called uh, Bloodwine, and Bloodwine is uh, was a is an African slave, and he uh, was a slave plantation, and they have find a, a James stone, and the stone is special for the the stone is from the uh, from the alien world. But the special thing, the thing with uh, blood wine is that he can force force people somehow commit a crime or a murder murder to so witness the pain of the victim that they have killed. So he he's similar to the Ghost Rider uh, in that, uh, that that type of way that he used his game stone that to uh, force in fear in the opponent with the thing they have done and he first uh, appeared in the DC Comics 1992 uh, and especially in one of the comics the, the, uh, the Man of Steel led up to Death of Superman with the Doomsday so Bloodwine is one of the uh, Justice League of America especially when they fight against Doomsday and he is uh, he, and so and his ability is to, uh, to, he's a necromancer, so he can bring up the dead, like the ghost of the dead, to punish the, the people that have killed that person. So he can, so he can, uh, especially so, uh, so, uh, all the victims and all the pain and all the suffering is in the stone that he used. So when he attacked, uh, when he uh, f uh, used his necromancy on the, the, his opponent, he's gonna force the opponent to witness all the suffering of the people they have killed and in generation of generation of people have died is connected to the stone. So that is uh, one thing especially with his power um, uh, and so on. So yeah, so he's a bit like uh, uh, the ghost rider in that sense that he used the death of the victim uh, on the person that have killed the victim to uh, to so they can feel the pain what they have done uh, so they really can see the the, the how like the victim die uh, and the other thing about blood wine is he's uh, one of the member of the uh, Justice League of America uh, and he also use and the other thing about him is the other thing about blood blood wine is that he's uh, when they when they fight that's a special thing when they fight against Doomsday, and Bloodwine was kicked in the fi in the fire uh, in the in the street fight of, against the Doomsday, the other team like the I uh, Ice and Green Fire, and Maxima and Superman and Gold, uh, uh, Blue Beetle and other guys don't remember, um, uh, they. They know there was not blood wine. For the blood wine was not there. There was other person that have uh, um, transformed to blood wine. So the person they so those they fight was the man Martian Manhunter. So that is special for uh, Martian uh, Man. Uh, totally butcher his name. I absolutely say, the green guy in DC Comics. The with the uh, so on. He is very very weak to fire, and that they know understand that he was not. Um, uh, blood wine, but uh, there was some uh, something that blood wine was captured in game stone that the red blood uh, stone that the, uh, there was um, and so on. and that, uh, some short back back uh, paddling in the story of the uh, blood wine is that blood wine's uh, ancestors was slave in a, a very very brutal slave uh, camp, and the the man was very evil. And I think, I, 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 I'm not really sure, but if this is true, that they kill the slave owner and they, they find the James stone in the slave uh, uh, place, in, the sla in slavery. And that stone uh, they used magic on to uh, put uh, the evil slave owner in, in the James stone. And that is the way that uh, the, every generation, like almost like Phantom and uh, Ghost Rider, that they generation after generation, they uh, they take like uh, I, I don't know if blood. Uh, somebody, somebody have really have to correct me if I'm wrong here. Uh, if blood wine 
is just a one title is many titles. One thing I think in Blood Wine is many titles. Like everybody, if they have the stone, get the power. So it's not, not like Superman or um, uh, Phoenix or other person with, uh, with uh, power, like, uh, like magical or uh, physical powers, or special powers. I think that's a special thing, like almost like Green Lantern. It's more like Green Lantern. So it's other body, some other body get the ring. They get the power of the of the Lantern ring, and that is special with blood wine. So everybody should have the James Stone, the blood James Stone. Uh, all of them can use the power of the necromancy. That they can force uh, the, the the criminal to vic uh, to to see the pain of the victim that have killed in a special way and where he can really do his, um, so that is the, um, uh, special with blood wine that he yeah so he's it's like ghost right? he used fear and um, and so on so that is my uh, uh, very very uh, simple very very simple story uh, about blood wine and it's lots and lots and lots and lots of things that i have not to talk about about blood wine and maybe we're gonna, we're gonna talk much more but he's the more it, it, more deeply to his story about blood wine but the, this video is just uh, i want to speak about the blood wine in a simple way speak about him and give what i think and what i think is a really really like blood wine a really interesting character and i really really hope in the future in dc universe uh, in movies as we really we can do some uh, as we're gonna see some live action movies with blood wine um, like vixen uh, bronze tiger blue beetle and uh, other green fire and ice and many more of the in where there are not so much famous dc comic books heroes but I think that wine is a very, very interesting guy and I really, really, uh, really want to read more about him in comics. I really hope that they're going to do a new 52 or something else in the future uh, about the blood wine and more uh, abduct, uh, full story of blood wine's history. So we can really follow blood wine more deeply. If it's, he's very, very few things that we know um, in the history books of the comics, comic books that we know about the blood wine. So that I really, really want to look, uh, look more forward to that if they come in the future. And that's what I really want to say, um, talk about blood wine. And probably the next time uh, guy, uh, the person I want to talk about in DC Comics is probably going to be uh, uh, Frost. And uh, Frost is, is very, very famous. It's not a, sorry, very, sorry. It's not a famous, but it's, um, it's a... Uh, it was a, a hero from DC Comics, from uh, DC Heroes, Global Heroes. And I, I think uh, Frost is somebody I really, really, oh sorry, Ice. Ice I really want to talk about. And after that I want to talk about Green Fire. And uh, more. And I'm really going to do a more deeply story about them. Um, and then I will probably go back to... Um, uh, back to the other video with the bronze tiger and do much much better video about bronze tiger for the, this one was really bad when i do with bronze tiger and so i really really want to do a better video with bronze tiger more, much more deeply story about him and then i'll probably go back to blood wine and really 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 deep story about him so much i can find a story about him and the slavery and the james stone and the in the alien and the, the fight against doomsday and all this kind of thing so yeah, so this is what I really want to talk about, and yeah, thanks, bye.